assalamu alaikum everyone today we have started our unit 12 and we have done activity book 2 unit 12 let's see which pages we have covered today page number 34 is your homework we have given page number 34 in the homework what they have to do they have to count and they have to trace the numbers like books penguin is having three books so they have to trace uh, number three fishes there are two fishes four five snowballs so like this they have to trace the numbers on page number 35 is their homework as well that count and circle they have to count and they have to circle the different one like the first one is completed for them as well all of them is completed they have to just trace the circle five snowballs are here in this line but in one there are only four snowballs so they have to circle the odd one out now on this picture on this page page number 36 what they have done count match and draw they have to count the snowballs can you see the pingo pingo is having three snowballs and can you find any other one who is having three snowballs pinga is having the three snowballs so you have to match the pingo with pinga and can you see the pingy pingy is having five snowballs who else is having five snowballs pingu is having so you have to match the pingy with pingu and robbie and daddy is having two two snowballs so, so you have to match it but can you see ping is having only four snowballs and no one else is having the four snowballs so you will leave it now coming on to the next page count circle what they have to do uh, they have to plus the things so we have give them the concept of count over all how they have to do they have to count two balls two snowballs are before the plus sign and three are after the plus sign so what they have to do they have to count all together one two three four five all together there are five snowballs so they have to circle it all together how many books are here one two three Three books are here. All together, how many chairs are here? Two. Two. They have to circle number two. Four heads and four school bags. And in the in the space, there is some numbers. So what do you have to do? You have to trace these numbers. You, uh, if it's feasible for you, you can arrange one white crayon, and you have to trace these uh, numbers without white crayon. If you are not having, so you can take any other color else black, and you have to trace these number. Now count and color and count. What you have to do on these pages? You have to find the num sounds and you have to color them like sound n sound n is of green color so in this maze what you have to do you have to find sound n having only one hum and you have to do green color inside it and you have to count all together how many sound n you have colored so how many sound n are here one two three three sound n are here so you have to write three over here sound e igloo so you have to color sound e igloo with red color and you have to count all over how many sound e igloo you have colored and you have to write the number the space given after sound e igloo sound t can you see sound t which color is of sound t sound t is of yellow color so what you have to do you have to find the sound t in the maze and you have to color them and count their respective number in the space given below so let's move on to the next page this one page page number 39 you have to trace sound b and sound p mommy b and baby b baby p and mommy b and after this our activity book 2 has been completed today allah fish